Ascension lies right at the heart of the Atlantic Ocean. It's about seven degrees south of the equator and roughly halfway between South America and the African coasts. When it became an island, things like seabirds and turtles will have quite quickly colonized the island, taking advantage of that precious speck of dry land in the middle of the deep ocean. And also because of the isolation, some species have evolved on Ascension to be um, completely unique, found nowhere else on Earth. The other amazing thing about Ascension is that we've had very little human impact on the environment. Given how special the marine environment around Ascension Island is, it's no surprise that there were calls to protect it, both from the island and internationally. Our MPA was designated back in 2019, and it covers a total area of 445,000 square kilometers, and that's the entirety of our exclusive economic zone. Good data are going to be really important for us to manage the MPA properly. We really want all our management decisions to be made on the sound evidence base, but that is going to be a huge challenge for us. Um, we know there's some fantastic remote sensing databases out there, but getting hold of them and being able to analyze them is, is a real problem for a small island like ourselves that are very limited in capacity and just in terms of our computing power, but also in terms of technical expertise to, to really handle big data sets. The Global Fishing Watch portal is going to revolutionize the way we use remote sensing data and bring it together in a really accessible way that's going to quickly feed into management decisions we make. I think the brilliant thing about the portal is the way it brings it together and makes it so easy to use. So it's really simple to start looking for correlations, to look for patterns over time and space. One of the most important ways we hope to use the portal is to target our surveillance activity and then take effective enforcement action. We also hope to use the portal to track the impact of climate change on our MPA. We know it's one of the biggest threats to our marine ecosystems, but it can be hard to measure in the short term. Bringing those big data sets together means we can look at those changes over time and try and predict how it might affect our biodiversity. We want the Ascension Island MPA to be the best MPA in the world. And I know that's a big vision for a small island, but we do think it's achievable.